Welcome to Big Girls Fishing Adventure, where your adventure begins. Big Girls Fishing Adventure, sponsored by Kamuki, Neto Shop, Globro, Carrot Stick, Stream Breeds, Gulls, Limers, and Line Gutters. Remember, guys, fishing in the north is so awesome. Ha ha. Hey guys, welcome to Big Zal's Fishing Adventure. The other day on my YouTube channel, I got this young fellow asked me how to fix a walleye. Well guys, I know there's a lot of pros out there that knows how to fix a walleye, but I'm just here as a professional myself to teach this young kid how to fix a walleye. So, young fellow, watch this. I'm gonna teach you how, you, how to fix a walleye. It's really easy. I'll bring you closer there so you know. See those two fins? Put your knife behind. You cut down all the way down where you could feel the bone in the back. Slide your knife right through. Just like that. And just slide it against the bone all the way down to the tail. Flip it. Don't go right through. So it's easier for you. To just go on the skin. Take the meat right out like this. So it looks like this right now. And then once you're all done, you just go around the cage. It takes two seconds. There we go. See? Just bones. And you're going to have one little set of bone left right in the middle like this. So what you do, you cut on each side like this. There you go. Just make like a nice butterfly fillet. It's beautiful. And then um, I'm going to teach you if you want to put it in the freezer, you always need to put a little square inch on it. Leave it on. So I'll teach you how to do it without bones. Put it real closer again. Do you flip on the other side of your fillet? I'm going to teach you how to do it when you put it in, in the freezer. That's how I do it. I just do the same thing when I did on the other side. I go down like that. I fold. But you don't cut all the way down. When you're almost there, you cut right down through the skin. So it makes a nice... See this? So you got about your square inch there. So if an MNR comes at your house, he knows what kind uh, what kind of fish you had, and it gives an average of how old this fish was. Now what you do is you go around the rib cage, same way, like that. Take your bones out, and then go right in the middle. Take your little bone right in the middle, right out, like I told you earlier. There you go. Nice little butterfly fillet. And you still got your inch of uh, inch of skin on top. So the aminar could identify what kind of fish you had in your freezer. And you always, thing that's more important, so you always freeze it flat so when the MNR comes in your house he knows what kind of how big your fillet was so I always keep and make sure that you got your only your lemon in the freezer guys so th thank you for watching uh, how to fillet a walleye uh, so if you haven't you guys have any more question uh, don't be shy go on my youtube channel I'll be more than happy to answer any question that you guys have so thank you for watching and uh, stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe on my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching guys.
Thanks for watching Big Al's Fishing Adventure. Please don't forget to subscribe under the YouTube channel. And guys, don't forget, fishing is all for fun.